Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's tutorial, I'm gonna show you how I stack my five tier cakes. So to stack and tier your cake, you're gonna need scissors, spatula, your cake of course, dowels, an edible pen, and buttercream. So to begin, I'm inserting my dowel, marking the height, and then I'm gonna cut that down to the height of the cake. And since this bottom tier is a 12 inch, I'm doing 10 dowels. So I'm gonna cut the rest down to the same exact height when you're adding dowels to your cake, I like to add a few on the outer edge and then a few in the center. And I feel like this gives it a lot more support versus just adding them to the outer edge. And I inserted a little guide to show you the amount of dowels that I use on each tier. So after you've inserted your dowels, you're gonna add a thin layer of buttercream. And you wanna make sure that you're making this buttercream flat. If you just kind of do a big glob in the middle, then your next tier will sit uneven on top. So I'm just spreading that out thin, and then I'm gonna add on my second tier. When you're adding on your second tier, try to center it as best as you can. If you're using American buttercream like I am, once you refrigerate it, it gets super firm to the touch so you have a little wiggle room to move it around if you need. Now for the rest of the tiers, you're just going to repeat the same process. Now once I get to my third cake, I'm going to add in a center dowel. And the center dowel is just a skewer, just regular skewers that you can find at the grocery store. The skewer isn't as tall as all three tiers, so I'm just going to push it down to just about the center of the very first tier. And that will make sure that I get coverage between the three tiers. Now for the center dowel, I've added in another guide. You can either add in three center dowels or you can just do one. Um, for this one, I just used one, but if needed, you can add three and that'll give you even more support. And then once you've added in your center dowel, then you can just continue the whole doweling process. I'm adding on the fourth tier, adding dowels to it, and then this is all I'm gonna do now. Um, once I get to the venue, then I'll add on my last tier. So after I've stacked those four tiers, then I'm gonna go in and fill in any gaps that I have. And for this, I'm just using the same buttercream that I frosted the cake in, and I'm taking a damp brush and lightly running the brush over. Okay guys, so when you're going on deliveries, you always wanna take a little toolkit with you. So I have some skewers on there. You always want to have skewers just in case. You never know when those will come in handy. So I just take a few. Um, I always take a napkin. Um, some toothpicks, whether you're using flowers or not. I take those. Some spatulas. Scissors. Your buttercream. Um, I had more in here, but this is what was left. And some gloves just in case you can't find a sink to wash your hands there. I also take a paintbrush, the same one that I use to fill in all the gaps on the cake. I just don't have it in here. Now once you're at the venue, you're gonna just do the same steps. A little buttercream and then stick your cake on top and then fill in the gaps. And that's how you stack your five tier cakes. I know these big cakes can seem a little intimidating, but they really can be so simple. Just don't overthink it and don't try to overcomplicate things. 